Okay guys, what is up? Today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get 120 FPS on Fortnite Mobile or more FPS if you guys want more FPS. So the first thing you wanna do is go to Fortnite and go ahead and press uninstall. Okay, once you have uninstalled Fortnite, then the next thing you're gonna do is go to the description of my video. And so you wanna press on the first link and it's gonna take you to this website right here. You're going to want to go ahead and press download, download again, and then install. Once you install that, here's what the app looks like. So once you have installed this app right here, what you're going to want to go ahead and do is open it. Then you want to go on Fortnite and press install. I already installed it. Obviously, that's why it says open, but you want to open it and press install. Sometimes there's a problem where it says you're not able to download this app or download failed. All you want to do if that happens is swipe out the app, delete it, and install it again using my link that I showed. And this time when you open it, download this one first. Install this one first. And then after you install it, delete it. And then go back to Fortnite. Okay. Once you, once you delete that, go back to Fortnite, then install it, and it should work. I don't know why that happens, but I don't know. I had to do that like a couple times because it wouldn't let me download Fortnite the first time. Uh, yo, what's up, boys? Basically here, I forgot to say this, but you're going to want to go ahead and open Fortnite and let it run through the update. Not the update, but like you have to download the kind of app again. It's like the, you know, like the 13 gigabyte update that you guys have to do once you open Fortnite. And once you do that, you're going to want to go to the lobby and go ahead and change all your settings back because it will reset some of your settings probably just make sure you're on like max fps and like all low graphics and stuff like that and then once you do that then go to the next part of this video then you're going to want to go ahead and swipe out of fortnite open this pixel app again open the pixel app again um there we go open the pixel app and this after you download Fortnite already, what you're going to want to do is download this one, Void FX. Go ahead and press install. Open. And what you're gonna want to do is change all these settings. So if you are if you have a 120 hertz device, then go ahead and put 120 FPS. If you do not have a 120 hertz device, do not put that. If you only have a 90 hertz device, put 90 FPS. If you have a 60 hertz device, put 60 FPS. 45 hertz device, then put 65 F or whatever, put 60 FPS. Uh, I mean, 45 FPS. So the way to check to see how much hertz your device has is basically you're going to want to just go. Just go to Samsung or go to, go to your browser and search how much... Uh, Hertz of screen refresh rate does my device. So my device is the Samsung Tab S9 plus half question mark. So go ahead and ask that on Google and it'll tell you mine has 120 Hertz. So I can use the 120 FPS method. So I put on 120 FPS. And you're gonna to want to put show FPS on, so we can you can go ahead and show uh, what your FPS is, so you can prove you can see that it's working and the FPS is actually increased. The rest of them don't really matter. I just have random settings on, so it doesn't really matter though. VSync off is something that you do need though, because VSync kind of makes the game laggy if it's on. So just turn that off. And other than that, just press apply settings. You will have to watch an ad, unfortunately. Okay, guys. So. Finally, watch the ad. It's going to apply settings and you're going to press OK. And once you do that, you're going to want to go back into the Pixel app. Again. Open it again. Then you're going to want to go ahead and install Fortnite again for the second time. And you're going to want to press on update. It, it'll shoot. I did not. I was not able to show you guys. Hold up. It'll say update at the bottom instead of install this time. So just make sure you press update. And then once you do that, press open. Sorry guys, I didn't realize you guys couldn't see. And I will show you guys that it works. This time you won't have to update, thank God. 
And as you guys can see up here, I am at 120 FPS. And I do have a really good tablet, so it's pretty consistent. Some of you guys' devices may not stay consistently at 120 just because your device isn't that good. So you might have to go down to 90 even if you have 120 hertz refresh rate just because your device isn't that good and can't really run 120 hertz even though it thinks like it is able to run it it just doesn't do it consistently that's just because your tab your device sucks like respectfully it just sucks so you might need, just need to go down to 90 but other than that guys that's the tutorial thank you guys so much for watching make sure you hit that like button if i helped you out in any way subscribe to the channel and if you guys have any questions about anything that i can help you with having to do with Fortnite on Android or Fortnite Mobile in general, please let me know and I will definitely uh, answer all your questions in the comments or if I need to, I can make a video about it if it's something like big that I need to address, anything like that. So thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great rest of your days. Love you guys. See ya.